Hello and welcome to Saturday Afternoon Football. I'm Dennis Cometti. Good to be back in Perth. With me is a legend of the game, Matthew Richardson. Hi Dennis, great to be here. Today's duel is between the Eagles and the Crows. Banners ready for the players. West Coast are coming down the race. The look ready and rearing, and the crowd are right behind them. Banners ready for the players. We have the toss of the coin. The Eagles kicking to the left of screen. This is a clash that makes King Kong versus Godzilla look like a chimpanzee's tea party. The players are all eagerly awaiting the siren. The first quarter has begun. It's not about being better than someone else. It's about being better than you were the day before. Hit by Jacobs. Gibbs boots it. Guided down nicely by Shepard. Duggan with the mighty fist. Nelson taps it. Crouch taps it. Malira with clean hands for a difficult bouncing ball. Clean tap by Malira. He picks it up. Takes a trip to the candy store with that move. That's a very well executed goal. Adelaide takes the first goal. He's putting on a masterclass with goals like that. Malirik loves that. Both Ruckman have their eyes on the ball. The ball is bounced. Jacobs aims for his man on the ground. Jams it on the boot. Great mark. McCaig slams it on the boot. Yet his eye on the ball all the way and took the mark well. Crouch can be very consistent. He does still need to do some more work to make sure he brings his A game to every match. Nelson boots it. He wins the contested mark. Crouch kicks the ball. Laird takes the mark uncontested. Chips it down towards half forward. Jenkins just stopping for a quick dance. He shows the quick hands. He gives the ball away. Marty onto the ball. The Rats taps it. Guided by Douglas. Clean tap by Schofield. Laird controls it. Laird gets the tap. Guided by Schofield. Laird aims for his man on the ground. Tapped by Gibbs. Nelson with the kick. Nice mark there. Booted by Brown. Marks. Bicep sends the ball on its way. Nice mark there. Opportunity for McGovern. This will certainly test him from this distance. He's kicking on about 45 degrees from here. Yeo with a chance to level the scores. The first goal for West Coast. Yo will want to try and wheel around onto his favourite foot, but he's still very capable on the other. Lucky we have that goal recorded because it was first rate. Dio celebrates. Umpire has the ball ready for the centre bounce. One down by Jacobs. Vardy controls, is in his possession. Puts boots a ball. Stuck the mitts out and held on to it. There's a vast chasm between him and the goals ahead. She holds his breath. He's missed the goal. 
the Eagles by a point. Chaney has got good knowledge of the game and he can see the events unfolding in front of him, but he just needs to react a little faster. Douglas takes the mark. Sending it on its way. He can't bring that mark down. Passes by hand. He misses his target. Otten boots it. Good mark. Gibbs can no hurry as he prepares for the kick. 50 metres out. You back him from this position. Gibbs aiming for the goals. Gibbs with a great kick. He sinks his first goal. The Crows take the lead. The kick is about as straight as a shopping trolley, and it's a goal. Gibbs knows that was something special. You can feel the intensity build as both Ruckman prepare for the bounce. Jacobs punches. Vardy controls. Guided by Blair. Laird gets the tap. And he's heading for home. Laird takes a shot at goal. Chalk up a goal for the Crows. That's two in a row for Adelaide. Adelaide leads by 11. Laird seems like he's enjoying his footy. I think he's going to be around for a long time. Well, that's what we've come to expect from him. Fantastic goal. He's happy with that effort, and so he should be. The Ruckman, conscious of where their teammates are, they wait for the bounce. Tapped by Jacobs. With the ball now. Gibbs has the ball. Going for goal number two. Drifts wide to go through to the behind. Adelaide with a two-goal lead. Shepard would like to think he hits all his targets, and for the most part, he does that. He drops the mark, gets the loose ball. McKenzie boots it. McKay marks the ball. He kicks the ball. He marks the ball. Nice bit of power, then. Duggan gets the upper hand. Low kick. Great mark. Chewie intercepts the bouncing ball. Schofield dodging for no reason at all. Hands like dinner plates. Brooks kicking the skin off that one. Deft touch from Chi. Douglas guides it. Takes control of the bouncing ball. Duggan guides it. Guided by Lacroix. Tap by Chi. He kicks quickly. That's a very well executed goal. McGovern with his first. West Coast trailing, but they can still easily catch up from here. He'll kick. It's not a bad sort of a kick either. It's a goal. McGovern celebrates. You can feel the intensity build as both Ruckman prepare for the bounce. Lysette has the passion for this game, and that shines through every time he plays. He boots it. McGovern with a point. They may have no option but to kick it long up the middle right here. Jams it on the boot. Brown claims the ball. Slams it on the boot. Laird takes the mark. Boots it. Marked by Malira. A low stabbing kick. Takes it well. Otten is a great overhead mark but anything below his knees and he struggles to get down for. If he can add that to his game, he's going to go up another level. Gibbs kicks for goal. A nice contested mark. 15 metres out. Betts likes his chances for goal. The Crows with the upper hand in this match, and it shows on the scoreboard, leading 25 to 14. That replay shows just how good that goal was.
congratulated by his teammates. Umpire has the ball, ready for the centre bounce. Claimed by Jacobs. Exclamation point. How about that? Puts the head down as he runs in. Miss for a behind. The Crows by two goals. He's searching for his teammates. Shepard plays on. Sends it on its way. Hutchings having no trouble taking that one. Hutchings, it's a smart guy, but he's got to keep it cool ahead so he can make the right decisions more often. Atkins with the kick. He gets the upper hand. McGovern shoots it. A magnificent kick right through the middle. That will settle his nerves. The first goal is always welcome. He'll kick. It's not a bad sort of a kick either. It's a goal. McGovern loves that. You can feel the intensity build as both Ruckman prepare for the bounce. Jacobs gets the tap. Wow, some of his hits border on felonious assault. I said looking to make them pay for that turnover. Time to check those stats. The handball stats show that the two teams are fairly even with West Coast on four and Adelaide on three. Adelaide with 25 kicks and West Coast with 23 kicks. Not much in it. Thanks for that, Richard. Let's get back to the action. Always make a total effort, even when the odds are against you. Jacobs nicely outclassing Blyset. Gains possession. Gets boot to high. Archie, the better man there. Puts boot to ball. Great grab. Schofield in no hurry as he prepares for the kick. Douglas Marks. Adelaide for having shots for goal on the run rather than looking to hit targets inside 50. And why shouldn't they when they have so many quality kicks in the team? Yo, shoots for goal. Magnificent kick of the footy. West Coast trail. That replay shows just how good that goal was. Dio celebrates. A brief moment of serenity before the ball is bounced and the Ruckman unleash. I set without a touch the clearance by Jacobs. Laird feeds it wide. Out on the full. Free kick to the Crows. Boots it. The contest, no match for him. Redden keeps that one low. Nice mark under pressure. Shuey always has the ball on a string. It's a mark. Puts boot to ball. Laird spills it. He knocks it down. He gets a fist to it. It's in his possession. Jacob's timing terrible. He's leaving his messages before the beat. Gains possession. Atkins looking a real threat out there when he pulls in contested marks like that one. Stuck the mitts out and held on to it. Crouch squares his heart on his sleeve and he just bleeds for this footy club. 
He gets boot to the ball. Ha Ching's just wanted it more then. He kicks the ball. He comes off hands. He steals the ball on the bounce. Gets a handball to the running man. Misses four behind. Adelaide in front. Might have to kick it to himself. Plays on. That kick is covered a very long distance. Duggan with clean hands for a difficult bouncing ball. Guided by Schofield. McKay taps. Crouch gets the tap. McKenzie did not ease up. He picks it up. Approaching the goals now. Has he? Yes, he's paid it. O'Brien with a relatively easy shot. And the ball goes over the boundary line. Close to goal. The umpires with a good throw. Jacobs with the hit. Going for goal number one. It's gone through for a magnificent behind. The Crows lead West Coast. He looks for a man on the lead. He had his eye on the ball all the way and took the mark well. Hutchings really wears his heart on his sleeve. Redden puts his boot on it. That's a nice strong mark. Duggan kicks it. Archie with the mark. He slams that on the boot. McGovern with the spill. Dances around the boundary line. He receives the handball. Crouch taps. Deft touch from Schofield. Marston taps it. Wow, what a nose for those loose balls. Oh, that's just giving the ball away. Douglas swoops on the loose ball and will have a change of possession. The ball goes over the line. The umpire will launch it in from the boundary. The Ruckman jostle for position. Jacobs decisively. Duggan just stopping for a quick dance. Hands like dinner plates. Don't take too long lining up the goal. Invariably, the mind messes up more shots than the body. Gio pulls the trigger with the ball sailing for goal. The Eagles trailing by less than two goals. Well, that's what we've come to expect from him. Fantastic goal. Gio loves that. All is in readiness. The ball is bounced. Jacobs wins the tap. Terrible timing by Lysette. Crouch puts his head down and runs in. It goes through for a behind. The Crows with a handy break leading West Coast 35 to 26. Their disposal efficiency has been fantastic, but West Coast need to begin taking more gambles if they're going to cause some damage on the scoreboard. He could not have kicked that any better. The replay capturing everyone's attention. What a goal. He's excited about that one. The umpire set to bounce to restart the game. Tap by Jacobs. Crouch with the football. Vardy with the interception. Boots it. Marks. Hit by Darcy. Strong mark. Gets boot to leather. Nice hands. Kick short. Waiting for some men to free up down the field. Kick by Schofield. The contest, no match for him. Lysette has no problems mopping up the loose ball. Mistakes are rare for him. He steadies now in front of goal. She kicks the ball. He grabs it, lining it up with the goal now. McGovern tries his luck with a shot at goal. The Eagles trailing by less than two goals.
There's one for the time capsule. McGavin celebrates. Ruckman awaiting the bounce. Both rucks have a fair shot at this one. Palms it down nicely. Vardy with clean hands for a difficult bouncing ball. Jacobs hardly provided a challenge. Douglas decisively. Deft touch from Gav. Jacobs has got a great technique, but he needs to put a bit more beef around his shoulders to be a real bone cruncher. He taps the ball. He taps the ball. He's got the ball out even when being tackled. Shuey finds the running player. Yo gets the ball. His approach looks good. She marks the ball. He kicks it. She he sinks his first goal. West Coast have scored the last two goals. Only the smallest of margins in it now. There's one for the time capsule. He's enjoying that goal, and why not? The Ruckman giving each other the ice-cold killer stare-downs as they wait for the bounce. Jacobs really gets onto this one. With the ball now. Has it now. Ball up in the center square. I set directs it down. Let's go to Richard now and take a look at the stats. The Eagles are behind on the scoreboard, but the stats are in their favour. They need to turn some of that magic into goals. Hmm, that's pretty deep, Richard. An interesting first half. Let's see how the third quarter pans out when we return from our halftime break. The players have had a good break. They should be ready to bring this game home. Do not let what you can do interfere with what you can do. Jacobs, I have no idea how you managed to get that out. The umpire will ball it up. Jacobs thumps it forward. Deft touch from Crouch. Tapped by Gibbs. He gathers the loose ball. Moves it quickly by hand. Approaching the goals now. Hands like dinner plates. 25 meters out. A chance to add one more to his tally. Adelaide in front. McGovern has got a few tricks up his sleeve, so defenders will have to be on their game. He'll kick. It's not a bad sort of a kick either. It's a goal. Very happy with that kick. Ruckman awaiting the bounce. More bounce than a dodgy chip. Jacobs is just a real slippery customer if you give him any space. Puts boot to ball. The mark will be paid. He kicks the ball. The mark will be paid. He puts power behind that kick. Vardy takes the mark. Kicks. Smith ran to meet the ball and took the mark superbly. Nice mark there. Kicks hurriedly. He scoops the ball off the ground. Gibbs puts it on the boot. Shepard marks. Kicks it. Dropped by Vardy. Very quiet by his standards. Schofield aims for his man on the ground. Crouch gathers it. Guided by Crouch. Shuey with the tap. Crouch with the tap. Shuey with the tap. He controls the bouncing ball. Wins the hard ball. Hit by Barras. Has he? Yes, he's paid it. 50 meters out. Kicks the skin off him. Crouch taps. Guided by Cripps. Is in his possession. Approaching the goals now. Slots it. He sinks his first goal. 
the Eagles. No time to drop off. Less than a kick the difference. Barras. He's got good knowledge of the game and he can see the events unfolding in front of him. But he just needs to react a little faster. That replay shows just how good that goal was. The Rats shows the goal umpire the right signal. All is in readiness. The bounces straight up and down. Jacobs with the punch. Vardy controls it. Duggan has had plenty of it with Joe. I can't believe it, Dennis. He just keeps surprising us up here in the commentary box. He has clearly been shopping at Clangers or us. Hutchings can achieve anything he sets his mind to. The sky is the limit for this guy. Cleanly tapped out of the ruck. Hutchings hits it. Jacobs gets onto the ball. He lays off the pass. Nelson with the pick up. McGovern dodging just for the fun of it. Nice kick. Betts gets number two. The Crows starting to exert some dominance over West Coast with the lead at 53 to 44. He'll kick. It's not a bad sort of a kick either. It's a goal. He acknowledges the crowd. All is in readiness. Bounce goes the ball. Jacobs with the tap. He's got the football now. A great effort. McKay sends the ball on its way. Simply outplayed the opposition there. He kicks it long. Cripps marks on the run. Sends it on its way. Nice mark there. Misjudged the stopping distance there and runs over the line. Both Ruckman battling for the front spot. Clean tap by Glycet. He's like a flamenco dancer after a coffee break. Schofield. He gets above the crowd. Jams it on the boot. Seedsman has it. Seedsman has the passion for this game, and that shines through every time he plays. McKay, with the kick, just wasn't able to grab it cleanly. Ball up cool. Guided down nicely by Glycet. Tapped. By Barantz. Laird taps. A loose ball scooped up. The ball came out of the pack like a wet salmon. Duggan sends the ball on its way. Let's have the shot at goal is as good as the delivery. This will certainly test him from this distance. This 45 degree angle shouldn't be too hard for Chu. Having a big day going for goal number four. You get the feeling something big is brewing. Yo, he's got good knowledge of the game and he can see the events unfolding in front of him, but he just needs to react a little faster. I'll put a cork in that goal. That's vintage stuff. And I bet he'll only get better with time. He's excited about that one. All is in readiness. Look at that bounce. Palms it down nicely. Bumped by Vardy. That decision was like taking a beer to a job interview. Not a very good idea. Gibbs slams the ball onto his boot, trying to get it away as quickly as possible. 45 meters out. O'Brien with a kick at goal. O'Brien slots the goal. The Crows fight now. O'Brien has the passion for this game, and that shines through every time he plays. He'll kick. It's not a bad sort of a kick either. It's a goal. O'Brien with the goal, and he runs back into position. Umpire has the ball, ready for the centre bounce. Lysette taps it. Gio made the awkward bounce look easy. He's got great hands. The umpire will ball it up. Cleanly tapped out of the ruck, Douglas scoops up the ball. Yo picks it up. Shuey dishes it off to the running man. Shuey takes a shot. Oh, and it's gone through for a behind. 
The Eagles will need to dig deep to fix the scoreboard deficit they face to Adelaide. Cheney waiting for his teammates to break. They're using the Tokyo subway play. Kicks. Not a pretty drop punt, but it gets away okay. He kicks it. That's a ripper. He kicks it. If anyone ever doubted your value to this side, young man, you've just blown it away with an incredible goal. There's one for the time capsule. She happy. The Ruckman conscious of where their teammates are. They wait for the bounce. O'Brien, it's just a real slippery customer if you give him any space. Puts the head down as he runs into goal. He gets it under pressure. McGovern has a kick. That miss is going to come back to haunt him. He has a few options. Chini kicks to himself. Jams it on the boot now. And the ball goes out of bounds. The umpires with a good throw. I sit with a big fist on it. Shuey gets the tap. Tap by Crouch. Schofield decisively goes short with a hand pass. O'Brien with the kick. Richo, how well are these teams performing? Both teams are neck and neck for handball disposals. Neither team showing any superiority in the tackling count today. Really close, locked horns in the tackle contests, 21 to 15. Thanks for sharing that with us, Richo. Here we go for the last quarter. After each game, I always wanted to be able to say, I gave all I could. I gave it my best. Lysette tackles him to the ground. He taps the ball. Shuey by hand. He slams that on the boot. McGovern with the ball. He's a long way from home, but he's a chance. McGovern shoots for goal. Hit the point post. Out of bounds on the full. Boots it. Gibson claims the ball. A cool, calm head, clearing it out of defence. A big kick by Smith. Shuey has a great set of hands. Fantastic mark. Shuey would have to be one of the most consistent performers in the competition. He's the type of player every coach loves to have in his side. He gets boot to the ball. He wins the contested mark. He steadies now in front of goal. West Coast will be on top if this one goes through. She nowhere near goal. Level scores now. Needs someone to break out. He's ready to bring it back into play. Gibson got under it. Clears now. Crouch wins the marking contest. He kicks it long. Takes it well. Puts boot to ball. Tap by Shuey. Tap by Lysette. Clean tap by Shuey. Kicks it. Yo marks on the run. Yo seems like he's enjoying his footy. I think he's going to be around for a long time. He steadies now in front of goal. He kicks the ball. He marks the ball. Yo with the shot. The mark will be paid. Let's have the shot at goal is as good as the delivery. 20 metres out. The ball is slammed towards goal by McGovern. 
That's two in a row for the Eagles. There is enough time left to steal the lead here. Replays are great when you can see how talented these guys are at conjuring something out of nothing. McGovern knows that was something special. Umpire has the ball, ready for the center bounce. Tap to advantage. My set gets a hard bump from Crouch. The ball being picked up before it makes its target. That drop punt works well for Tsui. The Rats had it, lost it, kicks it. Nice mark under pressure. Keeps it close to the ground. Archie takes the mark uncontested. Archie wears his heart on his sleeve and he just bleeds for this footy club. Lysette has a kick. McGovern has a kick. That's a great goal. The Eagles by two goals. That replay shows just how good that goal was. Congratulated by his teammates. Ruckman awaiting the bounce. The ball bouncing well. Jacobs punches it. The bouncing ball is controlled. Gibbs throws the ball. Free kick. Kicks it long. Grips from behind. Chips it down towards half forward. Gibson takes it well. Puts boot to ball. He has to hold on to those. Tapped by Gav. With the ball now. Going for goal number five. A miss from Gio. The Eagles over. The Crows by 13. Needs someone to break out. He's ready to bring it back into play. The spiraling torpedo from Cheney. Good tap from Marston. Good drop punt by Brown. Snatches at it and drops it. He's as twitchy as a frog in a blender. Takes possession. Shuey comes away with the ball. It's like he has the ball on a string. Malira guides it. Tap by Jacobs. Otten down. That's pretty serious. He'll be out for at least the rest of this match. It's disappointing for a team when they have such a dominant ruckman who can direct his hitouts to teammates, yet his teammates butcher the ball moving forward. The Crows need to start capitalising on his superiority. Seedsman has the ball. He has the ball. Yo hits it. Jacobs taps it. Brown gets it off the ground. Gets boot to high. Beds takes it well. Be decisive. Come on, be decisive. A wrong decision is generally less disastrous than indecision. He's kicking on about 45 degrees from here. Gibbs shoots. A mark by Lynch. 20 meters out. Well, if you could hand pick a position, this is it. Straight in front of the goals. Two goals will see Adelaide in the lead. Lucky we have that goal recorded because it was first rate. Lynch loves that. Both Ruckman have their eyes on the ball. And there's the bounce. Good fist. Hearn made the awkward bounce look easy. He's got great hands. Laird going for number two. He's missed it. The Crows will be trying to kill the momentum of the opposition. Shepard is a smart guy, but he's got to keep a cool ahead so he can make the right decisions more often. It's been intercepted by the opposition. He manages to intercept the bouncing ball. Nelson boots it. Gaff with the spill. Passes by hand. The Rats kicks. McGovern takes the mark uncontested. 
He spears the ball. Vardy presents and takes the mark. He kicks it. I lost the words after that kick. Can you help me out, Richard? I don't know what to say, Dennis. Chini waiting for the man to free up. Has he? Yes, he's paid it. She. That's a ripper. McGavin. McGavin, goal number four, and I'm sensing there'll be another, and maybe even more, given the opportunities he's getting. The Ruckman steal themselves before the bounce. And there's the bounce. Jacobs hits it. Has it now. Deft touch from Duggan. Tap by Gibbs. Takes control of the bouncing ball. Vardy with the ball. What a valiant effort from the Eagles. Well, I enjoyed the match, Richo. How about you? That's just heartbreaking for the Crows. So close yet so far at the final siren. They can take solace from this loss, however, and look to rebound next time they take the field. They will hurt. Final scores, Arc 79 to 66. Thanks for joining us. As always, it's been a pleasure. We look forward to seeing you back soon.